Hey, what's up guys? This is Star Raging, and today I just thought I was going to do a tutorial on disabling Smart Resample in Sony Vegas Pro 12. So, um, as a lot of people know, um, Smart Resample is the stupid thing that the software does to, like, it, I, like, I don't know, it like blurs motion or something weird like that, and it just makes the video look terrible. And it's actually kind of annoying to disable. You have to go to like every single clip and disable it. You have to like right click property to disable. Or I don't know, you can do something else where you like select all of them and like click somewhere. But I feel that I've found an easy way to actually disable it. And so um, what you're going to do is you're going to copy this text. I will have it in the description for you to copy. You start from right here on the using system and then end with this and so copy that from the description of this video and then you're going to paste it into a notepad document and so once you've done that I actually have it right here and then uh, you just name the file like smart resample disable dot text and then you click to rename the file and you change it to um, instead of dot txt you change it to dot cs and click yes and that'll change the name of the file and then what you do is you go to your um, sony vegas directory so c program files sony vegas pro 12 and then you want to find the script menu folder and then you'll take the .cs file that you created with the code in it and you'll just paste it right in here I've already done it so I'm not gonna move it in here but you would move that right in there and so I'll show you in Sony Vegas what that actually does so um... have this load real quick alright so um... let's put some clips in there uh, let's just pull this in here this commentary did so um, see like imagine you have like a ton of clips in here and normally for each click you'd have to like right click properties disable but now that you put this script in the actual program all you have to do is go to tools scripting and then you find the smart resample disable that you put in the actual script in the files and so and then you hit properties and as you can see it changes and that doing that actually will change every single clip that you have in there so I, what I like to do is I just make the entire video and then when I'm done with it instead instead of having to like go through and disable all of them I can just tools I'll go through it again. Tools, scripting, smart, resample, disable, and that disables it. It's I I think it's a lot easier than, um, you know, going through and clicking each of those things. So, uh, go ahead and subscribe if you found this tutorial helpful. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching.